Welcome to Factorization Force. This is one of my favorite games on the site and will help you practice your prime factorization skills. The idea is to make factor trees until you can make a factor a factor forest. There are two modes to this game. There's a time challenge where you try to get as many prime factorizations as possible in three minutes. Then there's a design a forest mode where you just try to make a forest and there's no time limit. I'm going to design a forest right now. Click Design a Forest, and you select a seed. What kind of tree, what kind of factor tree do you want to make? Well, I grew up in Pittsburgh where there's a lot of maple trees, so let's do a maple. Now, here's how you do this. You'll see the number 49 here. I'm going to click on this plus to start making my branches. So 49, I know, is 7 times 7. Same thing as 7 squared. So that 49 is an easy one. So I come down here and I put my 7 here. And then in my exponent, I put a 2 to indicate square. And that's all I have to do. Squared. That's all I have to do for this one. I click question mark. And I was correct. And I've made my first trait. I can drag it anywhere I want in this, in this landscape. Right now, it's just a plane with a river going through. I need to make this little forest. So I'm going to leave it right there. Grow another tree. Let's do an oak tree this time. My number is 18. I click the plus. So let's say 18 is the same as 6 times 3. 3 is a prime number, so it cannot be factored anymore. But let's continue to factor 6. 6 is... 3 times 2. Now all of the numbers in the branches, the 3's and the 2's at least, are prime. So I have a, let's see, I have a 2 and I have two 3's. So let's do 3 squared. Let's add this, let's, let's click this plus button so I can put the 2 times 2. So 18 is 3 squared times 2. Click the question mark. I've made another tree. So let's move this there. Let's grow one more tree. Let's make it a pine. Now my number is 27. So what two numbers when multiplied together give you 27? 9 and 3. So 3 is prime, so I can't do anything else with that. But 9 is 3 times 3. So now I have three threes. So 27 is actually 3 to the third power, or 3 cubed. So I put my 3 here, put a 3 in the exponents box, click question mark, I made a pine tree. Beautiful pine. I'm going to move that right here. I want to do one more. I really love this game. Let's grow one more tree. Let's make it a walnut tree this time. Now I have 77. Now 77 is made up of two prime products, 11 and 7. So I'm going to go down here. I can't do anything else with those because they're both prime. 11. Oh, and I'm just going to, I can't put anything here, so I'm going to put my plus. It's simply 11 times 7. Question mark. I do this big, beautiful walnut tree. I'm really making a forest here. Let's put him on this side. One more. Let's do a beach. So 128. Wow, this one's a little bit, this one is, this one is challenging. So I know 128 can be 64 times 2. 2 is prime, but 64 is not. 64 is 8 times 8. Okay. 8 is 4 times 2. The other 8 is also 4 times 2. And each of these 4s is 2 times 2. So I have a whole lot of twos here. So we have to, let's count how many twos we have. Okay, so we have, we start here. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Two to the seventh power. Click the question mark. I'm correct. And I've grown, I believe that was a beech tree. And he's behind right here. 
So I've made a nice force. That's how you play factorization force. A great game for reinforcing prime factorization exponents and prime numbers.